Welcome to the World 24 News Channel. Zaporizhia nuclear power plant being transferred to Russian operator, official claims. Russian officials have announced the Zaporizhia nuclear power plant will now be under the jurisdiction of Russian operator Rosenergodom. According to the Institute for the Study of War, ISW, Russian Deputy Foreign Minister Andriy Rudenko claimed that staff who are critical for the plant have signed contracts with the Russian company, and authorities are now exploring the creation of a security zone around it. Staff from Ukraine's nuclear energy company Energodom still operate the plant, despite it being under the control of Russian forces. Emergency hourly power outages enforced across Ukraine Emergency hourly power outages have been enforced across Ukraine after Russia launched rocket attacks on energy infrastructure. Ukraine's national energy company, Ukrenergo, said the outages applied to residents in Kiv, Chernihiv, Cherkasy, Zhytomyr, Sumy, Kharkov and Poltava. Dipropetrovsk, Zaporizhia and Kirovorod have been placed on emergency shutdown schedules, it added. Since early October Ukraine has seen a number of attacks take place on its critical infrastructure and power sources. As a result thousands of people have periodically been left without electricity and water. And, at least 74,000 Russian soldiers eliminated since war began, Ukraine claims. At least 74,000 Russian soldiers have been eliminated since the war started more than eight months ago, Ukraine has claimed. In an update on Russian losses, Ukraine's defense ministry said around 2,734 tanks, 5,552 armored combat vehicles, and 1,442 drones have also been destroyed. Obtaining data about losses on the battlefield is particularly difficult, and each site in a war will have a vested interest in making the numbers suit their needs. Western officials have not provided a recent estimated figure, 